Hi guys, this is Courtney. Okay, today what I want to do is show you guys how to add a WordPress blog to an existing domain. Now, WordPress comes in two flavors. You have uh, your WordPress.com site, which is the free version of WordPress. And um, I suggest if you don't have a web page, you don't want to pay for hosting, you just want to get some content online and start a um, a web page, uh, WordPress.com is is the way to go. Now we also have WordPress.org. This is the paid version of WordPress, which is the one that you're going to use when you have a domain name and you have a hosting company um, hosting your domain. And HostGator is pretty much the de facto, uh, I guess, web hosting service out there now. So I'm going to basically add. A WordPress blog um, to my existing domain, okay, on my newbie marketer online.com site. Now, I could actually do this by adding a directory to um, my account here through a file through an FTP client like FileZilla, but what I'm going to do is do it through HostGator so you see really how simple this is which is just a matter of adding a directory so to log into your control panel through your provider whatever hosting service you have at least on HostGator you just go to your domain.com um, slash cpanel and that's gonna get you into your control panel okay your front end for where all of your domains are you will have to enter your password of course and y your name to get in there now this is the main um, domain newbie market online and the other you can have subdomains under that and additional domains under that but we want to add it to this one my main one so continue down here and there's a neat little program called Fantastico Deluxe let's click on that and there's a ton of, of different um, add-ons that uh, they provide you through HostGator with. Um, we're going to go down here to WordPress. And we're going to do a new installation. And as you can see, we're already here on the main domain. Okay, We have the others there. We're just concerned with the main one. We want to install it in the directory. I'm just going to call this blog. Now you can name this whatever you want, but this is going to be the extension that's going to show up here. Um, and that's going to be your path. Now you just want to go in here and as far as your credentials go, whatever you want to log in as, you're going to put that. And then of course, you're going to put a password in there as well. And then go down here we can leave all of this the same and let's go ahead and install WordPress bang it's done um, it's really quick as you can see the installation is finished it's telling us right now that our blog is going to be the domain name dot com slash blog which is exactly what we want now let's hit finish on that and it's going to come up here and it's going to just give you some additional information we actually want to go to the blog now. We're going to go ahead, let's open it up in a new tab. And now, of course, we have to log in. Now we're going in the admin area, which is fine. That's, let's just go ahead and go in. And then we'll go ahead and open it up and let's take a look. It's going to be the default theme, as you can see. Um, they have a new basic theme here that is pretty much it as far as loading a WordPress blog as an extension or a directory basically to your main domain now you can also if you want well I'm not gonna get into that I'll do a separate video on how to do it for instance so that it says blog dot your domain name dot com I particularly don't like that I actually like to have everything as an extension of my main site but 
there is a way to do that. We'll talk about that later. But for now, I hope this has been helpful. And I'm going to do another video on how to go through and start setting this up so that um, you can get started, learn how to do that, some important things you need to know which are going to help you with um, your um, page optimization. So thanks for watching. Uh, this is Courtney from uh, Newbie Marketer Online. Thanks for taking the time to watch this. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.